What's up guys, just a quick heads up that the music was blocked in this video due to copyright, so I have muted the audio. However, I have provided a link to the song in the description, so you can open a new tab and listen to the song alongside with my reaction. Or you can just join me on Patreon for unedited footage. But for now, enjoy the video guys. Man, sometimes there is just so much music. <laughs> How are you guys doing? Are you guys doing okay? I hope you are. Thank you so much for clicking on the video, for being here today. We are going to listen to a little bit of Cat Stevens. We're going to listen to the first track off of his album, T for the Tiller Man, uh, the, which, which is Where Do the Children Play? This was released in 1970. So we had actually quite, quite a while ago uh, listened to two tracks off of this album, the actual last two tracks, Father and Son and T for the Tiller Man. And I really, really, really liked those two tracks. And I've always been meaning to come back to this album because I, I've i sincerely enjoyed those two and listened to the rest, but I just, like I said, there, <laughs> there really is an insurmountable amount of, of music to get to, um, but I definitely do want to return to this now at this time and uh, really get into this because I, I, mean, I don't know how much else I can say, but I really like those two tracks, so I really just like to continue on from here. Uh, now with uh, Cat Stevens, his music does get blocked, so it's going to be cut up on YouTube. Click the link below if you want to watch the full thing. It's right there for you. It's provided freely. Just click there, and you can watch the full thing. But yeah, let's go ahead and get into this. Where do the children play? You know how you know you're getting old? You know how you know you're getting old? Because when I look outside, and if there's ever, like... We have a, there's like a tree kind of like to the side of the yard. If there's ever kids like playing in the yard or in the tree, I'm like, why are they in our tree? Why are they playing in our yard? <laughs> That's how you know you're getting old. They're not even doing anything. I'm just grumpy old man over here. All right, this is Where Do the Children Play by Cat Stevens. Switch on summer from a slot machine. I know we've come a long way When you crack the sky Scrapers fill the air All right, Cat Stevens, Where Do the Children Play? Coming out the gate with very strong and rustic guitar, I really love the little the little vapor trails of keyboards that sneak in here throughout the track and the progression of it especially is very nice to hear because overall two-thirds of the way it's pretty much a a soft reflective relaxing relaxing <laughs> relaxing uh look at the world right and where do the children play we'll get into the lyrics later but then the drums come in and they only come in for i mean they, i don't i didn't like really time it but they don't come in for very long they're there to make a statement they're there to make an impact they're there to move the the music forward and how forward does it move from that point forward? <laughs> forward from that point forward. Um, in, in just that small section where the drums are present, the music changes as well. From a soft-spoken statement into something a little more biting. Listen to Stephen's delivery, how that changes. His tone begins to become a little more uh, bitter. And not sarcastic, but with that same kind of tone. Angry, for lack of a better word. It, it really boils down to anger. Because at a certain point, I mean, we guess I guess we have to look into the lyrics to really get this point, because I do want to get that down. Let's go ahead and talk about that as a whole. Well, I think it's fine building jumbo planes or taking a ride on a cosmic train. Switch on summer from a slot machine. Get what you want to if you want to, because you can get anything. So he's already making a statement. You can build your planes, you can go gambling, you can do all these things. I, you know, that's not a problem. I know we've come a long way, we're changing day to day, but tell me where do the children play? So already the statement, or that question rather, has been made. Where do the children play? Okay, well so far there's not really a conflict, right? At this moment, there's not a conflict in the interest of the children and the adults, right? Well, you roll on roads over fresh green grass for your Lori Lowe's pumping petrol gas. And you make them long and you make them tough, but they just go on and on. And it seems that you can't get off. Well, I know we come a long way. We're changing day to day. But tell me, where do the children play? So now we're getting the progression. Now we're getting, you know, building and rolling over nature, rolling over the grass, tearing down forest and woods and etc. To build cities and buildings and, you know, getting gas and every, all this stuff. And I think that you've probably seen a lot of that happening. I've definitely seen a lot of that happening in my lifetime. Uh, short as it may be, you know, in some ways, but things change. 
Malls are built, malls are abandoned, malls are torn down, buildings are built, and soon all the green lands that perhaps you saw as a child are beginning to turn uh, turn a suburban chrome. <laughs> and once again, he asked the question, where do the children play? And I like how he acknowledges right before that, we're changing day to day. Society, humanity is going to move forward and progress, typically, at least technolo technologically, you know? And he's like, I understand that. And that's good. That is a good thing. But as we're progressing, keep the children in mind. Just, just, just keep that in mind. Not, I mean, not really even in the back of your mind. You should be keeping that kind of in the front of your mind. And it's a simple question with a lot of implication, which is what I like as well. It makes you think a little bit. While you've cracked the sky, scrapers fill the air. Will you keep on building higher so there's no room up there? Will you make us laugh? Will you make us cry? Will you tell us when to live? Will you tell us when to die? I know we've come a long way. We're changing day to day, but tell me where do the children play? And that's where the, the drums come in. The music becomes a little more intense. His delivery becomes a lot more angrier. And that's where he's like, okay. <laughs> that's where he's like, he's, he's putting us down. He's sitting us down. He's like, okay, we've progressed pretty far, guys. We've cracked the sky. We got skyscrapers. How much higher are we going to go? So there's no room up there. And then he begins to kind of like <laughs> go on a tangent here. He says, well, well what else are you going to do? Are you going to tell us when to laugh? Are you going to tell us when to cry? Are you going to tell us when to live? Are you going to tell us when to die? Like, how much further are we going to go? Before we think to ourselves, as humanity, where are, or where do the children play? Where are they going to play? Do they even have a place to play at this point? And like I said, it's, it's more than just that simple statement of where are they playing. It's not just a literal statement. You know, are you uh, taking away all the things that not only, you know, we may have grown up with, but in a sense, are you taking away their childhoods? I don't know. There's a lot to think about on this track. And real, like, like I said, the music is just uh, simply brilliant, is I think a, a very nice way to put that. Anyways, let me know what you guys thought of the track. You can let me know your thoughts in the comments below. I hope that you enjoyed the music. I hope that you come back tomorrow for whatever else we're doing. You can follow me on Twitter. You can support the channel on Patreon. You can like the video. You can subscribe to the channel. You can do this, that, and the other thing. But I hope that you come back at least tomorrow or some other day uh, to watch a few more videos, to hang out with me a little bit more. And until then, I will talk to you guys later, guys. I'll talk to you guys later, guys. Bye. <laughs>